Hi, my name is Art Miranda. I am 33 years old and I was diagnosed with Bell palsy um, about five days ago. Um, I am a toy hunter, YouTuber, and a dad of uh, two with one on the way. I was, I guess this is my little story about me being diagnosed with Val Palsy. Um, it all started on Sunday. I was with my wife and we we're getting ready for bed. And I noticed something funny, little, something was a little weird, a little funny. Um, my tongue, started tingling and it went kind of like almost a little numb um, I'm alert I'm allergic to shellfish if you're ever allergic to something and you know when you eat something that you're allergic to where your tongue gets like that where it gets all weird that's what it started feeling like or but that's never happened to you you know when uh, um, you go to the dentist and you get your teeth worked on and a little bit of the Novocaine leads onto your tongue and you know how your tongue falls asleep that's, that's what it felt like at first. Sorry. <laughs> um, so I didn't think nothing of it. And then I, I went to bed. <clears throat> the next day, I woke up and I realized like half my face was down and I couldn't move the other side of my face. And this is the dumbest thing I could have done, but I just said, oh, you know what, whatever, it might come back, you know, maybe it's just a severe allergic reaction instead of seeking medical help. You know, in that type of situation, you want to get medical help. You know, it's better safe than sorry. While my wife was at work, I was taking care of the kids I decided to wait until she got home so my, my wife showed up around like 6 p.m. and immediately she knew something was wrong so she told me she she told me like we need to get you checked out so we called the ER and told them what was going on and they told us that I need to go to the hospital right away. So we, we went to the hospital because another reason why we went was because we started looking up my symptoms on the, um, the internet. And the symptoms that I had sounded a lot like a stroke. Well, like I said, I'm 33 years old, and I thought, hey, I'm too young to have a stroke. You know, this can't happen to me. This only happens to older people, which was something that's very dumb, and you know what I mean? You should always get checked out when this type of stuff happens. So I went to the doctors, and I got checked out, and um, they diagnosed me with Bell's palsy. This is really like my, my fifth day of having it. So I'm still learning how to talk properly. You know, because it, it's, it's rough. It's rough talking, especially in the line of work I do where I talk to customers all day long. Um, it, it's, it's been very difficult. I'm not going to lie, you know, it's been really difficult. But I'm not letting this get to me. You know, I'm still cranking out my YouTube videos. And... Um, still living my day by day you know like you can't let this stuff get to you you know if, if you're suffering with this right now don't worry you know what I mean I'm suffering with it right now too and but I'm still doing my stuff you know I like I still go do toy hunting and I'm still out and about with my family and, and stuff like this I do get looks I'm not gonna lie you know you won't wonder what's wrong with me but I'm still the same guy, same same person. 
It's just that right now, like half of my face is uh, uh, paralyzed. But I have noticed while dealing with this that like I feel my lip twitching and my eyebrow twitching. So I'm hoping that's good signs. Um, right now I do all the facial like exercises and doing these, you know, the, the doing the funny faces to try to to try to wake up my uh, uh, face and taking the medication that they prescribe me. Um, well, I'm just here to let you guys know that like, just because we're going through this situation right now does not, don't let that dictate who you are, you know what I mean? You can do anything, you know, sky's the limit. The only limitations we have in life is the limits that we give ourselves. You know, we, you can still do it, man. You, you know, I believe in you. You know, like Bell Palsy, is, is, is not that serious, man. Yeah, we're, you know, like, we, we feel we feel ashamed, we feel weird, we feel like all the looks at and everything else, and we just, it's kind of depressing a lot, but don't let that get to you, man. You can do anything. You can do anything. You know, and don't let this get you down. Like, I support you. You know, if you watch this video, I don't know if, if anybody will watch this video, but like if you watch this video and you do something and you have Bell's palsy, just put it in the comments, man. Let me let me freaking watch your videos and I'm gonna support you. You know what I mean? We gotta support each other. Um, also, I leave like my my Snapchat, Twitter, and all that stuff in in the the things. And if you want somebody to talk to you about Bell's palsy or whatever, feel free to hit me up. I'll talk to you guys. I'll talk to you, you know what I mean? And maybe we can help each other. <laughs> but I know I've been rambling for like a long time. So I know this was kind of hard to understand sometimes because the slurring and stuff like that. Because sometimes I, my voice comes back and I'll be able to talk a little normal and then it goes back to normal uh, to the Bell's palsy. So either way, I want to thank you guys for your time. I just want to know, let you guys know that I love you guys and you guys are awesome. You guys rock. And don't let nobody get you down. I'm here for you. Um, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep doing these. Maybe like every week I'll do like another update. Because when I was going through YouTube and I was trying to find stuff, all I was watching is stuff from like four years ago, three years ago. You know, nothing current. So. I figure I'll start doing that. Maybe I'll do it like every week, you know, like on Friday or something. I'll do an update and talk to you guys about my bell palsy and all the, the what's going on with that. So I want to thank you guys for your guys' time. Love you guys all. Love, peace, and taco grease. <laughs>